whoop de doo Let's go to Radiant Garden as Ventus. It's gonna be a fun time in combat level 4 Radiant Garden. I can't imagine anything going wrong. Ah, oh, how beautiful. Radiant Garden with all the flowers. And the fountains. And, uh... That's pretty much it. <laughs> oh, and a couple of Unverse. But, you know, who really cares about them? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Hi, my name is Ventus. It's Scrooge! It's Mickey! Ha <laughs> ha! Wait, did Mickey come here with us? And he's just like, well, see ya! I got better things to do. Mickey? Never mind. We came here separately at the same time. I don't care about Mickey. I want I want to go after Uncle Scrooge. Give me that. We get an Efer that I will never use. Efers do nothing but, like, slightly increase your focus gauge. And, like, as soon as you get damage siphon, you never need that again. And we're probably gonna get damage siphon this episode. Oh, Bowie Potion. So can I go to town and access the shop? I would really like that. Nope, we can't go to the town. I gotta go after Mickey, but Anka Scrooge went that way. So, Ventus is gonna go to a different part of town than the one Terra went to. We can finally go down this corridor. And it takes us to this beautiful gardens area. How lovely. Oh, and this also reminds me. We uh, never did show off the Mickey Mouse D-Link, did we? Oh boy! So we got Mickey's D-Link now. Just a bunch of sliding dashes and like a binding strike. But it does have Cura, which is nice. But Mickey's finisher is great. Light charge. If we time the button presses when the Mickey Mouse symbol goes over them, we deal a lot of damage. It's pretty awesome. And when we get a level up, we get auto teleport, which basically will occasionally teleport us out of the way of enemy attacks. It's interesting. Okay, we gotta take out these stupid mandrakes. They're sniping us from all the way across the stage. There we go, that was auto teleport <laughs> for us. And hey, these guys can drop abounding crystals for us. That would be great. Oh, and we get Mind Shield now. That's a great one. I'm much more interested in, uh, Light Charge, though. It's so fun, and you're invincible for the whole thing. Alright, you stupid bird. Get down here. Thanks, Sliding Dash, for being able to be used in the air. Any other enemies around here for me to use Light Charge on? Yeah! I think that's enough for Mickey Mouse today. Also, we still have not gotten Ventus's freaking counter yet. And I don't know why. I don't remember it taking this long, but... Alright, good job, Ventus. Oh, Zero Gravero is now max level. How wonderful. Uh, is there anything we could meld? Oh, we could meld Magnet with Magnera. That seems like a good idea to me. We'll attach a Pulsing Crystal to it, which gives us Magnega with Combo Finisher Boost. That's what I really want. Oh yeah, this is gonna be good. I should probably start getting some Attack Hastes as well. Those are kind of important. Look at how much damage Fyraga does, just because we have free fire boosts. I love it. 
All right. Oh, come on! I hate these mandrakes. They attack way too rapidly. Oh, that's... That's bad. Now we have to fight all of the enemies at the beginning over again. Wow, I hate the magnet. Or, I hate the mandrakes. Alright, well, kind of the same thing happened, except somehow I got more CP this time around. Also, I didn't get the Mickey Mouse D-Link level up, because of course I didn't. But this time, Zero Gravera and Fyra have both reached maximum level, which is nice. And I just realized we actually want to meld Magnet with Magnet, not Magnet, Magnega, so this is actually good. With Pulsing Crystal, gives us still gives us the combo finisher boost, which is great. I will equip that right down here. Beautiful. Now instead of these two, let's see. I'll equip two more blizzards. Those will level up quickly. And I now need to build my D-Link gauge up again so I can summon Mickey and get that leveled up. Treasure chest down this way. Yes, please. Wellspring crystal, yay. I don't think I needed any more of those, but I'll take it nonetheless. There we go. That's what I wanted to do last time. Oh boy, Thunderstorm leveled up. I love that. Something I'm noticing is that Ventus has really bad aiming when it comes to hitting enemies, especially when they're in a magnet cluster. Like, he keeps whiffing them. Terra never did that, bro. More enemies, hooray. Hey, I think this is the first time we've used the Diamond Dust command style as Ventus. Because we've been so fire obsessed. I'm sick of people interrupting my Magnaris. It's very, very rude. Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. We unlocked Surprise 1 because we, <laughs> we used I Need That Money so much. Well, how wonderful. Well, we gotta rename that one. Keeping up the trend with Spider-Man memes, the new version of that is called The Ad Said 3000. <laughs> I wonder why. Well, let's go back to I Need That Money so we can take more steps. And get closer to unlocking. I think that one is Twisted Hours. I don't think that one's any different. Mo the bottom uh, command stop the bottom finish commands I think are the same throughout all of the characters. And nice, we got a slow command. Now I don't have to buy one from the store. I'm actually very happy about that. Blizzard, Blizzard, Hungry Crystal, Blizzard with HP Prize Plus. Why not? Start learning that. We'll level up the thunder as well. Ooh, hey! Look where we are, folks. We're at the castle gates. Remember that Radiant Garden and Hollow Bastion are the same place, so... We're heading up into Hollow Bastion Castle. And we're about to see some familiar faces. Recognize them? Yep, it's Zaldin and Lexius. Or at least, they're somebody forms. Hold on. The castle is presently closed. But somebody just came this way. He's a friend of mine. 
We aren't aware of any visitors. Now run along home, boy, before the monsters get you. I could have sworn it was him. Huh? They're here. Radiant Garden shall not fall under the lights of you. Yeah. Leave this to me. Yeah. Stop! But you're just a child. Uh. Now, who do you think will defend the castle huh? if you two huh? go skipping off? But it's Vixen! That boy. Never <sighs> you worry about him. He's a special case. A what? Evan is right. Lord and Castle come first. The boy will have to fend for himself. Which reminds me, his lordship was asking for you. A heart devoid of darkness. Stripped clean of it at that. Very questionable. <laughs> Vexen is his same weird self. Zaldin and Lexius. <laughs> Brief cameo. But yeah, they're the castle guards for Hollow Bastion, or Radiant Garden. And I like how Lexius still has his axe sword, and uh, Zaldin still has his lance. It's a nice callback, or call forward in this case. You know me, I, lo I love all the fan service stuff like that. Oh, I hate you for interrupting my magnets constantly. There's a lot of them. Take that. That's what you get. Yay, we got our D-Link engage back up. That's good. Now we can D-Link Mickey again. Oh yeah, freeze raid. Now I don't have to meld it myself. Even though it's just strike raid plus blizzard. It's not that it's not that tough to make. And we got our D-Link Engage back up again. Oh, our cure reached its max level. Very nice. We'll, re we'll replace it with a brand new identical one. Also, yeah. So Terra saw a different part of the Trinity Armor, and Ventus saw a different part from that. Each character basically sees a different part of the Trinity Armor and goes running after it. Okay. So for this room... I'm actually not going to D-Link Mickey again. I'm actually going to D-Link Snow White. Because these Mandrakes can drop abounding crystals. And I want them to drop abounding crystals for me. However, they have a low chance. But with Snow White, we can boost that chance by using grump the Grumpy Treasure Raid command. There we go. Okay, no. I lock on to the one guy I actually want to lock on to. Great. Why are you the only one over here? You're supposed to have friends. There we go. Give me that abounding crystal. Yes. Oh, there. That's weird. Maybe there were too en maybe there were too many enemies that had already spawned in. So I had to clear some of them out first. That's actually probably what it was. Alright. Give me my abounding crystals. Alright. Doc, help me. <laughs> there we go. Okay, that should be enough abounding crystals for now. I need the abounding crystals in order to get Lucky Strike. Which means I can get more abounding crystals. 
that's going to actually help out tremendously. Okay, which enemies are going to be dropping the D-Link prizes for me? Because I really would like to get more D-Link prizes. I think you fat guys, you guys drop them, right? Maybe that's wrong. Nope. No D-Link prizes from them. Great. I ain't never gonna level up the Mickey Mouse one. I should probably get some Link Prize Plus commands, except I need abounding crystals to get Link Prize Plus as well. Oh. Look out! I will. I will. Scrooge probably had it under control. Wait a moment, laddie. Oh. Don't I even get a chance to repay you? Oh, you don't have to. No, just hold your horses. I didn't mean the fortune. Maybe a wee bit of gold uh. or put a small token of. Well. Could you make it fast? I know. I've just the thing in my hat. Hmm? <laughs> Come in. Don't be coy, Scrooge. You can tell me, lad. You came here from another world, didn't you? <laughs> Don't worry. My bill is sealed. Your secret's safe with me. I'm not be asking you any awkward questions. You see, it is the same with me. I asked a wizard named Merlin to bring me here from another world. After all, adventure is the mother of industry, eh? Eh? Great! That all? <laughs> Ugh, but I'm holding you up, lad, eh? Here, these are lifetime passes to Disney Town. You love buckets of fun there, but my name is not Scrooge McDuck. <laughs> there you are. Enough for you and two grown-ups. That's nice of him. Huh. Imagine if those are lifetime passes to Disney World. That would be a lot cooler. But no, we have to get Disney Town instead, which is a lot less fun. There we go, we get the Disney Town Pass, a lifetime passport to Disney Town. Cool, because I definitely wanted to go there. Well, I do love, I do love me some Uncle Scrooge, though. Uncle Scrooge, one of my favorite Disney characters. And it's definitely not just because I really love his Scottish accent. Mr. Get inside. It's not safe out here. Oh, ordering me about. Now that's unsafe. After all, I'm Merlin, the wizard. Put on some pants, Merlin. Oh, another scamp looking to wake the powers inside him. Is that it? What? How'd you know? <laughs> we wizards have a knack for knowing such things. The book is inside on the table. You may have a gander if you like. What book? Ventus, don't you want to go to Hundred Acre Wood? I know I do. Yeah. I also want to get the map of Radiant Garden. <laughs> Come on, we may as well. I want to unlock the honey pot board. Winnie the Pooh! It's the ultimate board. <laughs> it's Winnie the Pooh Candyland. Yeah! Command board for 100 Acre Wood. It's the greatest. Bonk! Block recipe! Oh, and speaking of which, before I forget, we got a shop here. I'm buying me another block. So we can get renewal block. Oh my gosh, I never equipped high jump. High jump. There we go. I equip high jump. <laughs> Alright, where? what else can we buy? We could buy ignite. I don't think we need ignite, though. Oh, uh, boop, 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 boop. We could buy Fandaga now, which is hilarious. 
And we could buy Fyraga. I don't think we need to buy Fyraga. But I will buy another fire. I'll buy just one more fire. We could buy Fire Dash as well. I actually will buy Fire Dash. Two of them. We also need to get some Fundaras. Which means I'm gonna buy three Thunders. Because I want to make some Thunder Surges, bro. <laughs> Believe me, I do. We only got one Quick Blitz, I think. Well, we, I don't think we need another Quick Blitz, to be honest. I'll buy, I'll buy Poison Edge as well. And Blizzard Edge. Why not? I mean, they are free, after all. That'll be it for now. I can buy more later. Wonderful. And now if we head into town, I believe this takes us to... No, it doesn't. Oh, now we're... we went here as Terra. Those D-Link prizes. I need them all. All of them. Do the ice cream guys spawn here as well? I think they do. Yeah, they do. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> Oh, don't leave! I want me ice cream! Oh, Well, I got a decent amount of ice cream uh, ingredients. That's fine. I think we have max level Thunderstorm now as well. That's pretty cool. Oh boy, our D-Link engage is maxed out again. Sweet! Yep, Thunderstorm. Okay, we're going back to Flame Solver then. Bit more powerful. I don't know why changing my shot lock has to uncharge all of my normal commands. I need that money. Surely I'm gonna get another finish command soon, right? With... I feel like I should, but maybe not. Once again, we get slight... Why did... Oh my gosh. I, I need to get some attack hastes. Desperately. Because, wow, that is slow to charge for one of the worst commands in the game. When it comes to combat, at least. I love it for its sequence breaking capabilities. There we go at last, counter rush. Man, I thought I thought Terra got his counter late. Nope, finally. Counter rush. Press X right away after a successful block to counter with a flurry of blows. Yes, it's about time. Okay, we don't need sliding dash anymore. We will start leveling up. Actually, not the fire dashes. We can level those up separately. I'd rather start leveling up the two fires. Oh, we can also meld the cures together. And I'll stick an abounding crystal to it to get Kira with Lucky Strike. Heck yes. That is something worthy to level up. Wonderful, yes. I feel so much stronger already. Well, missed the, missed the sticker, but that's okay. In the next world, we will get something that will make it extremely easy to get, like, all the remaining stickers. Barely made it. Hey, we're level 15 now. Radiant Garden is where your, your level really starts to skyrocket. Especially since 
It's just like, well, now I have every type of synthesis crystal and pretty much all of the basic commands you would ever need. So you can start basically making any command you want. Which means lots of level grinding. I don't intend on doing as much level grinding here as I did for Terra. So we won't be having like level 45 Ventus at the end of the game unless something goes very wrong. And this chest. Oh man, I thought they had the Esnua. Nope, just a Panacea. We're supposed to get Esnua in this world. And I'm gonna meld that to get the renewal block. Oh, another Fire Up. I'm happy. I love how Terra basically had no fire for his entire folder and Ventus is just swimming in it. Come on! You literally just attacked. Okay. Seriously? I was literally dodging it. Not you. Ventus will not freaking lock on to the Mandrakes. They are like the lowest priority enemies that he locks on to. Oh boy, I'm glad I got Shimmering Crystals. I actually need more of those. Not you. Exhibit A. <laughs> Took me ages to get Ventus to cooperate with that. I do love Treasure Raid, though. It's great for getting the materials you need. I was running a little low on Shimmering Crystals. Well, it's annoying to hit air enemies with the raid attacks. Hi, Potion. I was... Okay. I was really hoping to get an Esnua, but that's okay. That's perfectly acceptable as well. And here we go! Terra's already here, apparently. Even though we got to this world first. We really got held up at Scrooge's place. And here we go! We get to fight the Trinity Armor again. But this time, we're Ventus. We'll see how Terra fares as an ally. Out of all the generic unversed enemies, this this guy's probably my favorite, like, unversed-based boss. Defeat the unversed. Take out the arms and legs first. I love the rhyming. I really do. Well, first up, Flame Salvo. Oh, yeah! Oh, I love that. Take this! Ooh! Wrecked! I need that money. I probably should not be right here. Thank goodness they move around. There we go. Oh yeah. Right under him is exactly where you want to be. Fire. 
And this is why Fire Boost is crazy good. And there we go, we get more maximum HP, and we learn the Cyclone command style. Terra gets Rock Breaker, and Ventus gets Cyclone. Terra! Ben, now! Come on! <laughs> Easy. Bye bye. Got him. We make a good team. Sure do. Oh yeah, I got you these tickets. You didn't get them. For what? Someone gave Life them to you. Passes to Disney Town. <laughs> this scene he is so you... cringe, especially since you see it three times. He said to take two grown-ups. Apparently, in the Japanese version, when it says he said to take two grown-ups, he was actually saying take your parents. And so he's like, oh, I guess you guys are the closest thing. <laughs> you mean us? Listen to me, Ven. We need to get you home. It's okay, Aqua. Trust me, that guy in the mask is history. We'll never badmouth Terra again. <laughs> you saw the boy in the mask? Uh, he... Yes? Venetus. Ven. You let Aqua take you home. No way! I want to go with you guys. You can't. We have a dangerous task ahead of us. I just single-handedly wrecked that giant unverse Terra. I did way more damage than you did. I don't want you to get hurt. And what is this dangerous task, Terra? It doesn't sound like what the master told you to do. He told us to take out the unverse. That's pretty dangerous. Oh shoot. It might be a different route, but I'm fighting the darkness. I'm not so sure. I've been to the same worlds as you and I've seen what you've done. You shouldn't put yourself so close to the darkness. <sighs> Listen to yourself, Aqua. Terra would never- You mean you've been spying on me? Is that what he said to do? The Master's orders? He was only- Aqua? I get it. Terra! Just stay put. <laughs> I'm on my own now. All right. Terra, please, listen. The Master has no reason to distrust you, really. He was just worried. You're awful, Aqua. Wow. So now you know the truth. But the Master loves Terra. And you know that too. Were Aqua didn't even deny it. ordered to take me home? Aqua, now that you're a Keyblade Master, you've let it go to your head. No, she hasn't. I'm gonna go find Terra. He literally walked off about 10 seconds ago. Again, that scene in particular just feels like it's really forcing all these dumb things. Like, oh, their relationship's falling apart. Not because it naturally is, but just because the plot demands it. It's, it's annoying. I don't like it. There we go! Now we get Twisted Hours. I had- I thought we had to be close to that. Yeah, we- we've seen Twisted Hours before. But we've renamed it out of time. We at least gotta f f hit him with it once just to log it in our journal. But otherwise, it should be pretty simple. Boop, 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 boop. Problem is we can't really use our commands if we want to use the finish command. <laughs> Because all of our commands are elemental based. Oh yeah, so the Cyclone command style, so it's one of those level 2 command styles. You have to be in another command style in order to activate it, and you have to use wind based commands like Arrow to enter it. And you guys know how much I love Arrow, so probably won't be seeing that a whole lot. Ooh, wow, Aurora. Nice. I don't want to fight y'all. I want to go off screen so I can change my finish command. 
I'm gonna meld two fires together with an abounding crystal to get Link Prize Plus with Fire Up. Now we'll do Magnera Magnera with a Fleeting Crystal to get Magnego with Reload Boost. So again, that doubles the reload speed when we're low on HP. And I think that will do it for now. <laughs> I think we've had enough tea for today. Alright, so we can level up with the Fyra, and we'll start leveling up some of our Thunders as well. Actually, well, hang on. Obviously, we want the Magnaga in here. Wee! Oh, I almost forgot. <laughs> Finish commands. We're gonna go back to I Am Not Roxas just to start leveling that up. Now that we have tougher enemies that give us more CP, we should level that up really quickly. Okay, please let me D-Link Mickey Mouse. Yay. I wish Mickey had better D uh, commands in his deck for dealing with crowds of enemies. You basically have to rely on his finisher in order to do that. But even then, his finisher isn't amazing because you can't control where Ven moves during this. He just moves where he wants to. Which oftentimes can lead you into trouble. <laughs> Ooh, look at all those commands leveling up. I love it. Oh, yes, there we go. Auto teleport's not great, but at least we get more commands in here, like Mind Square. Or not Mind Square, Mind Shield. Here, we'll revert. We can always D-Link him again in the future. Now that we've got a Link Prize Plus, we should be able to get our D use our D-Links a little more frequently. I'm gonna buy two Quick Blitzes just so we can get some... Attack Hastes going. Oh no! It's Little Zexion! We're meeting all of the Organization 13 members here. Back before they were part of it. Take out all the Unversed. And I do mean all of them. Daw, okay. Let's get just enough D-Link uh, gauge so we can D-Link Mickey again. There we go. Wait, why does Magnet- why does Mind Shield have such a low recharge? I have five atta I have five magic haste, and it's a magic move. Alright. Let's go, Mickey. Good job! We hit them all in the front, and now they all self-destruct. I wish I still had my mind shield about right about now. Thanks for the auto-teleport, Mickey. Not a particular flashy- Oh yes! There's the other D-Link level. 
I sh I think we should be I think we should collect that for the, the answer, transition. Where are you? Answer me. Ah, there you are. Didn't I warn you not to wander off, child? I see we owe you our thanks. We have done our best to raise the boy, since his poor parents are not here to do it. Oh, you're on your own, huh? Everybody's an orphan in Sir, this game. I'm looking for a friend of mine. He's a tall guy dressed kind of like me. Have you seen him? Hmm. Perhaps I did see him in the outer gardens. Just follow this road. Thank you. No, thank you for keeping Yenso out of harm's way. And, well, let's say, I have a feeling we are destined to cross paths again. <laughs> That's a little ominous. A little bit of a blatant call forward. <laughs> yeah, so remember, the organization for team members, before they became nobodies, they had the normal names. Then they joined the organization. Zemnis is like, you can join, but I'm going to take your name, put an X in it, and change the letters around for a different name. So, Ienzo joined the organization and became Zexian. Same letters, but rearranged with an X in them. And we obtained Reversal. Use Reversal to quickly get behind an enemy. Lock onto your foe and press square just before it attacks. Reversals really pay off if your opponent is vulnerable from behind. Reversal is... So, it, obviously, it's fitting that we get Roxas' signature move, Reversal, after encountering the Organization 13 members as Ventus. Reversal is kind of weird. I'm not a huge fan of it because you can sometimes do... It's totally random, basically, whether you do that or a block in that situation. And sometimes you'll do a Reversal when you actually want a block and it can screw you up. I'm still going to show it off, obviously, but... Oh, yay, Fyraga reached its maximum level. Ah, oh, that's awesome. Yeah, so reversal. We don't even level it up. Can we attach? Nope. No, we cannot attach. So yeah, I'll show it off, but it's not the best. Alright, Fyraga plus Aurora with an abounding crystal will give us Fission Fyraga with Link Prize Plus. So you remember Fission Fyraga that we found in that chest in Terra Story? Ventus doesn't get it in a chest, but so we can meld it by melding Fyraga and Aurora together. Next, we have Blizzara, Blizzara Soothing Crystal, which gives us Blizzaga with Damage Siphon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we want that Damage Siphon. We want it so bad. Then we can get Thunder, Thunder with Shimmering Crystal for Thundara with Thunder Boost. Love that Joker. And that's just Peach. Whee! Let's go meet Terra in the Outer Gardens after he just unleashed the darkness and is trusting Master Xenonort when well, he probably should not be doing that. Terra! Hey, Terra. Man, you killed that guy real fast. T Clearly, this is not canonical to my playthrough of Terra's story where I spent so much time grinding before fighting Brag. Here, he just immediately made a beeline over there. Take me with you. I can't do that, Ben. Why not? I just... When I really need you, Ven, I know you'll be there. It would have been interesting if he had taken Ven along. Well, why wouldn't I? You're my friend. Tara's like, I guess. Yeah. Kind of. You're right. Thanks, Ven. <laughs> I think if, if Terra... When I really need you, Ven, I know you'll be there. <laughs> Why did we flash back to that when it happened literally five seconds ago? I think if Terra had taken Ven alone, it probably would have ended better for him. Oh. I better tell Aqua. I thought you said that Aqua was terrible. Why are you tattling, bro? <laughs> we can't enter this area because there's a waterfall going through it. And also Master Xenonort is holding a very top secret meeting over there. Of which we cannot know about. Okay, sure enough, yeah. So we did get the second uh, flower for Mickey's D-Link, even though it was at the very end of a scripted battle. So now it's Sorcerer Mickey, and his second ability he gives us is double EXP. 
So yeah, Mickey Mouse's D-Link is the only one of the only real ways of getting extra experience points. And Terra doesn't get access to it, so level grinding for Terra is a lot more annoying. We also get some new commands in here. Sign of Faith. Which is like a holy version of Aroga, which is interesting. We also get Mini in here, which is fitting. And the new finisher is Faith Charge. Which looks similar, except uh, we also shoot holy balls everywhere, which is amazing. So yeah, Mickey's D-Link is pretty awesome once you can level it up. Although the commands in his D-Link are still not fantastic. But his finisher is amazing. Yeah, here we go. Kaboom! Pulsing Crystal! Ooh, get shred. Surprised we went to Diamond Dust Command style and not Firestorm when I used Fish and Fireaga, but I guess the Blizzaga is like, nope, this is better. You know what? I don't care about those blimp bros. We can just leave them. Hey, Aqua. Aqua! Ben! Were you able to find him? Yeah, but... He's gone. Right. Then I can't stay here. Let me go with you, Aqua. No, Ven. Do as I say and go home. Oh. Why won't you let me? I don't want to put you in harm's way. You understand? Again, I feel like I know what they're trying to do here. Like, they're trying to kind of isolate the free friends and make them think like their friendship is falling apart. And they could have done a good job with it. They just need to tweak the dialogue a bit. Like, they could have Ventus protest be like, Aqua, I'm not weak. Like, I can go with you and, like, ha have some tension that way. Because Aqua, rem Aqua remembers what Ventus used to be like, where he was, like, catatonic. And, well, he had part of his heart ripped out to make the neatest. So, like, you could play it off that way where he's like, but I'm getting so strong. And she's like, no, but no, they didn't. It's just big miscommunication for between them all. Oh, Ven is sad. And when Ven is sad, uh, given up already? Come on, Ven. I thought you were stronger than that. <laughs> ben, you almost had him. Just try it again. Hey, wait. You're teaming up now? Uh, hmm? I like the callback to Riku saying, Come on, Sora, I thought you were stronger than that. I like the parallels. Ben, you see all those dents and mix you got? Each one of those is proof you're learning. You're trying too hard to move your body. You need to learn to let your body move you. Right? What does that even mean, Terra? Seriously, what? <clears throat> In your hand, take this blade. And so long as you have the makings, then through this simple act of taking, its wielder you shall one day be made. <laughs> What's that about? Who went and made you master? Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Well, you're not the only one. I know. 
You, me, and Ven all share the same dream. That's the same words that he said to Riku when he was making him successor. Ven still- I don't know why Ven is t keeping this, like, toy keyblade around when he has the real thing. Oh. Huh. <sighs> Look who it is! This yours? Lee, we don't have time for this. Lighten up, Isa. It'll only take a sec. You still play with toy swords? That's cute. Mm. Now this right here, ta-da! What do you think? Not what are those? <laughs> jealous. I'm Lee. Got it memorized. What's your name? Ventus. Okay, Ventus, let's fight. Fight? Why would I want to do that? You scared of losing? Come on. <laughs> Hope you're ready. Bruh, I literally have magic on my side. You're gonna get wrecked. Huh. Yeah, now we're talking. You're gonna be sorry. <laughs> it's Axel and Syx. And Syx actually looks happy for a change. Uh, yep. You had enough? Because I'm willing to call it a draw if you are. Huh? Right. From where I stood, the only thing you drew was a big L on your forehead for loser, lame, laughable. <laughs> what? Isn't this the part where you cheer me up or something? I love how Syx, aka Isa, has the moon symbol on his shirt. <laughs> You're just having a bad day, or that's what you get for pulling your punches. <sighs> Some friend. Oh, you mean I was supposed to lie? <laughs> You see wow. what I gotta put up with? Sure hope you don't have friends like him. Huh? <laughs> yeah, because re remember in Free 5 8 over two days, Axel and Syx used to be friends, and now they're not, because uh, Cy something happened to Syx to make him a grumpy old coot. <laughs> Lee, we have to go. Okay. Already? I'll see you when I see you. After all, we're friends now. <laughs> Get it memorized. Okay, Lee. What is it with you and picking up stray puppies? I want everybody I meet to remember me. Inside people's memories, I can live forever. <laughs> I know Come I won't it. forget you. Believe me, I try all the time. See, I'm immortal. You're obnoxious. You ready? Well, I can tell you are. Yeah. <laughs> you guys going to the castle or something? Man, we met, so we met, Terra met one organization member, and we met six, <laughs> six of them. <laughs> no sign of Demix, Larxene, Luke Sword, Marluxia, Damage and Larxene. Must be nice. <laughs> Knowing who your friends are. Vince is like, I don't know if I have friends anymore. <laughs> really? <laughs> really, Ventus. And here we get the Frolic Flame Keyblade based off of Lee. <laughs> a well-balanced Keyblade that provides an extra boost to all of your stats. Very disappointed we do not D-Link with uh, <laughs> Lee and Isa. Or at least Lee, but... Oh, uh, well. Oh, boy, folks. Now we unlock the next trio. Disney Town, Olympus, and Deep Space. Everyone's favorites. Not.
So just before we end things off, let's go take a look at that new Keyblade, Frog Flame. Hey, there we go, free free. That's a nice improvement. Let's equip that right away. As for our command deck, it looks like everything is still being leveled up. So that's where we're going to leave this episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. Next time, well, you know, I'll be honest. Disney Town, 98% of it is going to be the same between Ventus and Terra. So I'm not sure how much of this world I'll even need to show off next time. So I think next time we'll be playing Disney Town and Olympus in the same one. And maybe even doing some Mirage and stuff. Because both of those worlds are incredibly short. I don't know. We'll have to see you next time. Thanks for watching. And until we meet again, my friends, have a great day and God bless.